The game plan at age 63 was to dial back the clock. I'm the age Avenger. I am fighting it every step of the way, not just appearance, but the health from the inside out. Got to figure, you know, if you had one vehicle, you'd take really good care of it. Well, this is our vehicle. And if I'm 63, I could live another 30 years. So what am I doing to be proactive, conscientious, and know that there are consequences for everything that I do that's right and all those things that most of us would probably admit that we have slacked off in some areas. This is a chemical that is peeling off the top layers of your skin. They put the chemical on, but then they put something on shortly thereafter to neutralize it. At about the third day and going up through about day 10, you're going to notice that you are getting some of that skin starting to slough off a little bit. But take a look under that, under that brown spot is clear skin. I cannot believe it. And going back in for the next treatments, the nurses were able to see the effects that that skin peel had. Minimizing those pores, the fine lines, brighten the skin and the tone. Excellent. These are great first steps. Microdermabrasion. What a great start. Got all that stuff off the skin so that the skin was more receptive and able to take in the great skin care products. Obviously, Botox is something that, while well, I put on the list at top one, two, or three, because if you arrest the movement of the muscles that make all of these lines, then you are prolonging this appearance of youth. In fact, I would say the earlier you start, probably the more you're avoiding and therefore the more youthful from the get-go. Now the rest of the body, all of those areas that you just can't walk off or work off, but you'd like to get it off, I'm a fan of True Sculpt because this is something that can go in and target areas through a method of heating those fat cells to the point where they simply burst and therefore all the fat is going to be leaking out and flushing out of the body. It doesn't happen overnight, it happens over time and not much time at all because after about 12 weeks, that's when you're really going to see how much of that fat is gone simply by this treatment. The statistics say about 24%. So far on the journey, I have had microdermabrasion, a light skin peel, and Botox. Today, it's going to be the Pico Laser, and the target is age and sunspots. That make a person to look old and unhealthy. Ten days of transition. Required makeup. And then clear, clean, beautiful skin, hands and face. Next. I did the Pro Fractional Laser. That peel is something that's very dramatic. The Pro Fractional was wildly successful. First of all, it takes out the first 10 and 20 microns of the skin surface. So it is really taking you down to a place where the skin is fresh and honestly just beautiful. But in addition to that, it will go down with the other laser, 100 microns, 100 microns, and it's doing it in a pattern, almost like irrigating your lawn. Only then they're putting in the platelet-rich plasma that they're taking out of your own body. So it's not a foreign, it's just you using what you used to use unconsciously and involuntarily to make new skin. Now it's being incorporated back into your skin. And so that over the course of time, you're going to see fresher, more beautiful, more youthful skin emerge. The trick on this one is you're going to do it three times the first year. And that means that you've got to take at least two weeks for each one of them before you plan on picture ready or big event. But then every year thereafter, you just do it once. This is the most dramatic and long term. Now, the next thing will be fillers because we're losing our natural substance of fat that gives us so much of our youthful appearance. And the bone density is changing. I can't do anything with Botox to help for all of this, but if they do a little filler, it's going to really address something that's far more youthful and in another part of the face. So the fillers will be done, maybe lips, maybe cheeks, maybe hands, but the fillers are going to be the next. Is it over there? No, from feet to face, it goes on. It's a journey. I say, please, join us on the journey.